Good evening, YouTube. I just watched Iceman's very nice video on the Abyss Titalium, and he had a couple of questions, which I hopefully have answers for. His first uh, concern was, uh, where can you learn some more about security pins and what they're called and what they do and all this sort of stuff. So I've got two books that I recommend. The first of which is this one, Mechanical Locks, uh, High Security Mechanical Locks and Encyclopedic Reference by Graham W. Pulford. You can find this on Amazon.com um, and other places, I'm sure. Um, there are many illustrations of, oh man, yeah, I got the camera lined up good this time. Many illustrations of pins, pin systems. Um, here's an example of some of the pins from a, a DOM uh, IX uh, lock. Um, here is a Vinkhaus, if I got that right, um, with their crazy rewarding and keys. Um, he also talks about um, ace locks, how they, how they go together. Um, pretty much any kind of high security lock that was around at the time when he wrote this book, he's got covered. A very, some very cool lever locks, or cylindrical locks, he calls them. Cylindrical lever locks. Um, chub lock, even some automobile locks, things like that. So, very good book. Um, and uh, there's the ISBN. Um, if you'd like to pick that up, um, I think it was about $70 um, on Amazon. Then the other book, um, which is actually two books, um, is this behemoth from our friend um, Mark Weber Tobias, um, Lock Safes and Security. Um, this is a very expensive set. It's, I don't know, 1,500, 2,000 pages. Um, but he goes through in gory detail everything you could possibly want to know about locks, metallurgy, locking systems, master keying. I haven't even gotten to the second volume yet. Um, it reads a bit like a textbook, but it has just a tremendous wealth of information. Um, just to give you an idea, I think I bookmarked the table of contents. So he goes through um, you know, the tools you would want, materials and processes they, they use to make things, how keys work, high security keys, keying systems, different types of locks, specialized kinds of locks, um, entry methods, forensics, um, and then he goes into vaults and safes and, uh, and security concerns. So even just the first volume is a, a very good read and a great um, reference for um, for this kind of stuff. It's a little expensive, but uh, I don't know. I thought it was worth it. Um, so anyhow, if you could only have one of these books for the type of thing you're looking for, my apologies to Mark, but uh, I'd have to recommend this book. Um, it's not as detailed on a lot of things, but it gives you such a, a wide breadth of products um, that uh, that's the one I'd recommend. Um, the other question you had was about those funny little C-shaped clips, and those are called circlips. Uh, at least that's what I've always heard them called. Um, and um, as I mentioned in my comment, um, they are often referred to by various expletives, uh, profanities, uh, because they're such a pain to get on and off, uh, particularly off. Um, I happen to have a set of these um, circlip pliers, which are particularly good for circlips that have little um, rings on the uh, on the insides, but they work reasonably well. If you, uh, I think this this particular set of jaws works pretty well for um, for like for example taking um, euro cylinders apart, things like that. Um, and then of course you know pliers and uh, worst case a hammer, something like that, um, or a saw, that sort of thing. Um, Anyhow, circlip, C I R C L I P, I believe, um, and uh, I think these were maybe twenty dollars at my local hardware store. So anyhow, um, so there you go. Uh, it's my take on it. Maybe some other people have some other re recommendations for books or another name um, for the types of rings that these things remove. Um, one interesting thing here, you can actually set this up so that it can open the rings or close them. You swap it into this position, it can close them. So, very cool. Anyway, thanks uh, for watching um, and uh, look forward to more videos. Keep it safe.
keep it legal and um, keep it legal and have fun. Thanks. Bye-bye.